Hello everybody, VR designer Chris here, and this video is going to be my thoughts on the Razorback model done by Eagle Moss. I previously covered the Rossinante model that Eagle Moss was doing, and I had a lot of criticisms about it. I thought that the uh, Kickstarter Rossinante model had a lot of uh, better elements to it, but now with the Razorback model, I am impressed. Overall, I think that they did a really good job with this model. I can see that the shape of the Razorback looks great. The mold looks amazing. I, I think they did a really good job with the paint. Uh, look at all the little details, the logos and um, the little dots here, the uh, evolution of flight starting with Icarus and ending with the Razorback. I think these are really good overall i think they did a, a superb job um i think this model is a lot better than the than their ross and Ante model to be honest um and at the price 77 canadian dollars is not bad it's like 50 something us dollars i think that's a really good price for what it is um yeah so you really can't beat this price in my opinion I do have a small criticism though, and it might be a little nitpicky, but um, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the yellow here. It might be supposed to be gold or metallic, but I'm not, I'm not getting that from these images. I wish they would have went with a different color or um, like specifically, I don't know why the engine area is so black. I would have loved to seen some metallic like silver in the engine area but then again this is something that enthusiasts can paint themselves this is also my personal opinion you don't have to always agree with my opinion i just think that they could have chosen a better color maybe a more metallic uh, gold I, i'm not sure that's my first reaction to this uh ship is that i'm not a fan of these little highlights i wish they would have chosen a more metallic color or uh, a silver especially for the engine area i think we need some color variation it just look looks a little little to one one note for my opinion i think a little bit more color highlights here that were metallic would be better but other than that i think that's just, just a small little nitpick but other other than that i am very impressed by this razorback model i'm not a huge fan of their Rocinante model, but I do think they have the potential to make some of the expanse ships um, in a in a great great way, and I think they did a really good job with this. And the price I think is also reasonable as well. Um, and if you're asking, would I be purchasing this? Um, I think at first glance I will say no, and the reason why is I'm trying to downsize my material possessions. Uh, my apartment is very very small and normally in uh, non-pandemic times i'm usually living on a boat and i just don't have the room for it even for something as small as this and i have other hobbies that take up a lot of space as well and um, but do i think it's a good buy for you yeah sure um if you're into the expanse um i think they did a really good job another idea i had too is maybe purchasing it and uh, unboxing it on my channel and then maybe doing a little giveaway that might be something i'd be more interested in thank you very much for watching i got more stuff in the works in the channel i just uh heard the news that this model was coming up and thought that i had to make a video on it as always uh expanse content is what i do on my channel quite often i do other stuff as well so if you enjoy what you see please consider subscribing to the channel i'm really close to 2k subscribers and thank you very much i'll see you in the next one peace